welcome to this uh, another session of dw sim simulation here so we are actually trying to simulate a system uh, which is which forms a zeotrope actually so this is uh, this is a system we have taken and uh, <clears throat> now let us fix pressure as one atmosphere or let us say <clears throat> okay let me fix pressure as one atmosphere pressure i want to find a temperature between bubble point b bubble point temperature and dew point temperature where it will get flashed into vapor as well as liquid my motto is to i have a liquid i have a liquid i want to flash this okay i want to flash this okay so in the in the gas separator or in this particular flash vaporizer i am specifying pressure and temperature so that there is a separation of vapor and liquid phases that means there will be a two phase formation inside the tower this is the condition now <clears throat> okay let me all take this out and then first of all let us understand at what conditions no that means two uh, what do you call uh, phases are not forming okay let me take pressure as now pressure fix as one atmosphere and if i say this is completely liquid i am fixing it so i am taking this one atmosphere and i should press enter and this is totally liquid okay i calculate the pressure first or temperature okay so pressure one atmosphere and uh, as it is entire liquid i got bubble t as 55.8469 centigrade and duty how do you get duty i have to make entire uh, what do you call uh, the vapor fraction to be as one so that it is total vapor as a feed and then i am getting the temperature to be as something here temperature is to be as 56.2337 degree centigrade that means in between these two temperatures only two phase will be there but let us understand i give less than 55 and check whether there is a two phase formation i give more than 56 that means let us take 57 i check again what happens okay now i have to change the flash spec to temperature and pressure now the temperature i am taking it as less than 55.8469 and let us take 54 now i am mentioning two conditions for the or two variables for this particular gas liquid operate operator or gas liquid separator that means i have to specify pressure and temperature i have to find what is the liquid phase mole fractions i have to find what is the vapor phase mole fractions this is my requirement now <clears throat> I have given temperature 54, which is less than bubble point temperature. If you see the bubble point temperature, dew point temperature, dew point temperature is higher than the bubble point temperature. Less than bubble point means it is, it is completely in the liquid state only yet. Okay. Now, this particular place, if you see, this is a liquid phase. See, again, I am taking this with the arrow of the stream feed acetone methanol. I named this stream, uh, uh, stream as feed acetone plus methanol, right? If I move the cursor to this particular stream it is showing me temperature is 54 degrees area pressure is one atmospheric as it is we are specifying the operating conditions inside the tower okay now if i come come to this way this is a liquid phase and this is one kilomole per hour that means it is it should be entirely liquid only that means there will not be any vapor coming out so if i go to the stream three you see zero kilomoles per hour nothing has come out but entire one kilomoles per hour has come down and the total acetone plus methanol feed here acetone plus methanol is 0 0.6 and 0 0.4 totally it has come down to the bottom now in the same condition same fashion if i take this 54 as 57 that means more than due temp and temperature then again come back this is vapor phase now you see this is now see in the previous one if i say this is 54 
54 and see the vapor phase fraction is becoming 0 and if I say it is 57, you can observe in the simulation directly, it is calculating vapor phase mole fraction directly as 1. That means it is totally more vapor now. That means the, all the 1 kilomoles per hour will go as the vapor product only. There will not be a single mole coming out as the liquid. That is what is understanding for this. So what is the temperature between these two? So our interest is what is the temperature between these two? So which temperature we need to take and then solve? The temperature between these two, this should lie. That means the operating temperature here, this should be more than or let us write like this, T less than uh, duty, but it is greater than bubble T. Okay. This is the this is the requirement we need to actually understand and then we have to solve. So let us take a temperature of 50, 55.9 and let us take a temperature of 56. Okay. Now I go to this place. I mentioned 56 now. Now you see this, you should see this particular area. That means, you know, uh, let me actually circle it. This area is very important. You can see. What is a vapor phase mole fraction? 0.524445. It is not either 0 or 1. Now comes, that means now it is our responsibility to see whether there is a separation in the gas liquid separator based upon our theoretical assumptions, theoretical understanding, basics of theory. theory. Now see, the, it is inside, that means if you see the compounds, you know, oh, what happened here? One second. Let me actually, actually come back again. Yeah. It should be there. One second. Ah, properties. Oh, amounts. Amounts is acetone is 60%, 40% in the feed. So, whatever vapor fraction, what vapor fraction we have seen? We have seen the vapor fraction will go 0 0.5, 52445. 0 0.5 to 0.5. So, if you see this here, Mole fraction, you can see what is the vapor now, how much is the vapor going up. That is what it is showing. So it is coming here as vapor, vapor fraction, you know, point five two triple four five. Same thing we can see when I when I when I come to this particular place and see point five two triple four five as the Mole flow because feed is one kilomole per hour. V by F becomes F is one, so V is becomes V is equal to 0 0.52. And if I come down, the rest, the rest, the rest is what 0 0.47555. That means this particular equipment or this particular model, this particular unit, this particular module, which is set of equations, it has worked well. And we have chosen a temperature between the bubble point temperature and the dew point temperature given the temp pressure fixed, and we have seen there is a flash done with respect to this particular system. There is no flash when, when either the temperature is, when either temperature is less than bubble point temperature, bubble point, when the temperature is greater than dew point. Yeah, there is no flash now. So this again reminds us of the vapor liquid equilibrium concept wherein we draw T xy diagram at constant pressure we should know uh, what is the temperature versus x and y compositions from that diagrammatic representation we can also understand uh, keeping in view the feed composition 60 percent and 40 percent we can also see that but remind you the feed composition is plays a significant role here the feed composition is 60 percent that means acetone I am taking, if I consider acetone as more volatile component, because methanol boiling point is greater than acetone, we consider acetone to be as more volatile component. So the feed composition is with respect to the acetone, it is known as 60%. But if it is changing from 60 to 40, all these calculations, all these boiling point, bubble point temperature, dew point temperature, everything will change. Again, you have to redo the work. Okay. Uh, this session is on at what? given pressure or pressure is constant at what temperature in indirectly or the other way around theoretically speaking for any flash vaporizer to work or gas liquid separated to work you need to specify pressure and temperature for a given input given feed input 
data that means feed composition then only you can find at what temperature there is a vapor formation and the liquid formation two phase formation is coming okay bye